Hey y'all, it's Amanda with Tap Mom and the Bag Brigade. Guess what? <laughs> the tracking for my hubby order said it wouldn't get it till Saturday. Well, guess what? It's Thursday and my hubby order came in. <laughs> Almost two weeks. But, because the last thing it said was that it was in customs. And I'm like, customs? Okay, whatever. This is my first time ordering anything from overseas. So... Okay, customs. Uh, but here she is in all her glory. This is my one and only overseas order. I'm not going to order from Ice, even though I really love some of that Picasso yarn. Oh, that Picasso yarn. I have seen it and seen it and seen it. And, you know, and all of that ice yarn that, they, that I've seen on videos and everything, all of it's really pretty, but the only one that I'm interested in having is the Picasso yarn. I don't all that other yarn is very similar to the yarn we ha that we have in stores here and that we can get readily get. So that's the only one that we can't readily get is the Picasso yarn. And so that's the only one that I'm even interested in getting as far as ice yarn. And I've seen it on eBay and I'm still kind of on the fence on whether I'm going to order any, any from eBay. So I don't know. I don't have to have it. It's just one of those yarns that I don't have in, in stash and that I'll probably always want and won't break down and buy. <laughs> Just, you know, I don't know. Anyhow, so y'all ready to see this beautiful, beautiful lusciousness? I didn't get a whole lot. I got, you know, some lollipops and a, a cookie I'm reading from this list because it reads like I got some snacks. <laughs> I didn't get no snacks. I got an itty bitty piece of red. Uh, it tasted like cherry uh, hard candy shaped like a heart. And it was delicious. <laughs> you know, fat girl going to eat that piece of candy right away. <laughs> but I got some, some lollipops, a cookie, and a mega ball. Ooh. <laughs> All right, we'll get to the Mega Ball first. It's, it's the one that popped right up. Don't don't think that I didn't look at this before we sitting down here with y'all. But I got this. Uh, this is the thing that I added to get free shipping. <laughs> I should have just went on a paid shipping. It might have got here quicker, huh? Anyway, but I believe this this color was called Cobalt. But this it, for it, for color it just says eleven. But I believe it said I believe it said Cobalt. But uh, it's just blue. It's really beautiful. It's really soft. It's super, super soft. I give them that. It's very soft acrylic. 100% acrylic, 400 grams, uh, 700 meters, and 765 yards. And it's a four weight. And of course, I don't deal with anything else as far as regular acrylics go. But it's it's really, really super soft. It, I mean, no, no I, I, I'd compare it to Line Brand's P Pound of Love. I would compare it to that, even though it's it's smaller than the pound of loves. It's uh it's fourteen ounces versus the uh the I think pound of loves is sixteen ounces, so it's not as big. It's not as big, but it's be it's a beautiful blue. And here's one of the lollipops. Um, I can't remember which one this is. I I think this one might be key. No, this is not. I don't think this is Key West. I don't remember. I'm trying to see if I get it'll say on the actual. But it does say it's 20% wool and 80% acrylic. 20 grams. 382 yards. I got two of these. It does suggest that you use a 6 millimeter hook. And it is machine wash, but lay flat to dry. So, color three, it says. I, I don't. <sighs> this might have been Tallahassee. I don't remember which one it, this is. But I got two of this gorgeous, gorgeous thing here. Uh, I'm going to push that little in so y'all can see but y'all can see the layers. And this, I mean, it, the squish, the softness of this is just wonderful. 
it's really just really it's really wonderful i'm thinking wrap you know just a because it's got wool in it so just a nice little uh rectangle wrap to just kind of wrap around you and, and and when it you know when you're feeling a little chilly that's just my take on it you know and there's the other one but they are beautiful i'm really proud of them that this this is the only one because it because of course they shipped it in a bag instead of a box well you can send a box if you're going to send something overseas but this is the only one that got just a little bit lopsided <laughs> but it's okay it'll bounce back now that it's out of the out of the bag and this is uh a cookie see what i mean i got some snacks <laughs> got some lollipops and a cookie <laughs> and this is the bohemian and look at that oh would you look you know me i had to have some color i can't i can't i can't get you know plain dull stuff i had to have lots and lots of vibrant color and this definitely fills the bill this is called bohemian i think that's very appropriate and it's it is fairly thin so of course i'm going to probably you know see see how thin that is i don't know how they call that a four weight i really don't that looks more like a three to me but uh, i'm no expert but let's see what they say here it's uh it says 600 meters. I don't remember how many. It doesn't. It's not giving me the. It does have the Oka text um, standard thing on it. So that's good. I'm looking for other specs. 100% acrylic on these. But they do not suggest that you. Well, you could wash it in the washer, but don't don't put it in the dryer and don't use fabric softener it says i i like my fabric softener but i won't use it on it if they think it's gonna mess it up well i am not finding the yardage but it's a lot it, it feels like it would be a lot of yardage because of how thin it is and how big this cake is this is a big this is the, these are big cakes yeah they, this is there's two of course i bought two two of each thing that i bought i bought two of them uh because two strands but they're 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 identical as far as how they're how they're spun out you know they look very close you know so you don't have to worry about not looking right i think this is the one that's key west and this is amazing Oh, so bright, so cheerful. It just says spring, even though it has wool in it. <laughs> I don't care. It's gorgeous. So beautiful. I'm so happy to finally have these. <sighs> because I debated on whether or not I was going to order from Hobby because, or Hobie, however you want to say it, because it was overseas and I don't know how long it's going to take. It took just under two weeks so that's not too bad i wait i had to wait that long for line brand and they're in new jersey for god's sakes so <laughs> but of course i'm in the deep south and new jersey is way up north so that's almost like another country right no well okay <laughs> It is when you open your mouth up north. I've been up north before and opened my mouth and had a bunch of people turn around and stare at me because of my accent. I can't help it. I just can't help this accent. It's just how I am. It's just who I am. This is the same stats as it was for the other, you know, how I feel about blue and green. Ooh. And the next one's going to shock you. But this doesn't shock anyone that I ordered something like this because we, we know how I feel about color. And oh, oh, welcome, welcome to the family, little guy. <laughs> I don't know. 
one. There's the other one. Oh my goodness. So beautiful. I wanted to, I've mooned and mooned and mooned over these cakes. And and this this yarn this type of yarn from Hobie for ever since I got into this stuff. Oh, and another I guess this is another lopsided one. It's just a little just a wee bit lopsided, but that's okay. We don't mind. <laughs> Yep, down to the last two. And like I said, y'all y'all going to have to prepare yourself for this because I shocked myself when I picked these because these are just... But I have some of the crystal cakes in these colors. And so I thought, well, maybe this will maybe go with that. <gasps> Neutral color. <laughs> I think this is the one that's called Tallahassee. I think this is the one that's called Tallahassee, I think. But maybe Genu ah wait oh it has a little thing out to the side. Let me look. Hold on, my bad. Color Yeah, this is Tallahassee. But this it's neutral colors, this creaminess, but it just appealed to me because it's just so pretty. It's just so smooth. You just I mean you this looks kinda like a like a like you pour too much creamer into your coffee and all of a sudden you got this nice little creamy effect, you know? You know, that kind of look. That's that's kind of what it reminds me of. Like you pour just a little too much creamer into your coffee and now you, all you got is creamer. <laughs> you know, a little bit of coffee right here. <laughs> but man, is it gorgeous. And so, so, so soft. All of these are incredibly soft. You would never imagine that a, a that a yarn that has wool in it would have this this squish factor to it. I mean, you could almost, if you if you had enough strength in your hands, squish it on the side and have your fingers touch through the yarn. That's how soft it is. I don't know any other way to explain it, but that's how soft this is. And I wouldn't do that because the ball band would pop and all kinds of kind of things would happen. But <laughs> none of them good. But, man, this is luscious. And, of course, there are two of them. So, that is my hobby haul. This is $100 worth of yarn that I'm showing you here. Is that this one mega ball. I got the, you know, this will go in the hat. Not This will go in with the yarn for the hat not hate uh, hats that I'll be doing. And, um. And this gorgeous, gorgeous little babies. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm acting strange. But I've waited for these. I waited for these. And now they're here. And I love them so much. I don't know. Can I get that one in? Let me see. Get this one a little love, too. Oh. <laughs> these, I tell you what, these from overseas. This, now, this, you know, this was a dream come true to have these, to be able to order from there and to have these. I don't know when I'll use them. I may just have them. And when we get to the new house, I may use them as decor for a while i i i don't want to get in no big hurry to use them um because they're just so beautiful and i just want to go through every so often and just touch them so i'm not going to get in a big hurry to use them because you know i don't know when i'll be able to order any more if ever so um i'm just going to enjoy having them i know that sounds strange to just have yarn that you just have to look at but um, when you wanted something and didn't think you'd ever be able to get it, and then you're able to get it, and you just want to look at it and touch it and, and know that it's yours and can't nobody take it from you, you know? <laughs> it, I know. I, it just, I, I try not to take things for granted because so much in my life has been, you know, had things come, people come and snatch things from me. And, um, 
So I don't take things for granted anymore. I, I cherish each and everything that I have and each and everything that God has blessed me with. So I'm going to cherish this as long as it lasts. And hopefully you all do the same. When God blesses you, you have to cherish those things because you never know when some something, you know, could come along and take it from you because that's just how life is. So live every day like it's the most treasured thing you have every day like it's treasured because every day is a gift from God. So anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this wonderful, wonderful Hobie haul video, even though it wasn't a huge haul because if I'd have really, I mean, I could have probably spent some more, but then I, I don't know where I would have put it all because <laughs> I'm, you know, running out of room for stuff, but, uh, I didn't want to go too crazy with Hobie and their, and their yarn because, well, I should leave some for other people. <laughs> No, I just wanted to be modest about it and, you know, just get what I wanted and not go cra too cra too terribly crazy. So I got what I wanted and, and you know, what I felt like I, I was comfortable spending, you know, without going overboard with material things. Sorry, Axel's won't love, but uh, <laughs> when does he not? <laughs> Every opportunity that I'm sitting up like this and not sitting back in the couch, he comes up for head scratches. But, uh, opportunist. You're an opportunist. You know that. <laughs> I love you, though. But, uh, anyway, um, I hope you all are having a wonderful Thursday. I'm gonna, um, hmm, find the prettiest thumbnail for this video and, um, uh, upload it for y'all. Uh, but, uh, Please remember to adopt uh, your next fur baby from the local shelter and don't buy them from a breeder. It's the best choice you can make for your best friend. They're waiting for you at the shelter. <laughs> I tell you, I, I can't even sleep without mine anymore. Well, I got one sleep likes to sleep on the, on the floor right next to the bed. Sometimes, sometimes he likes to sleep in the bed with us. Uh, Axel likes to sleep on the floor right next to the bed bed a lot of times instead of in the bed and then theo is right near my legs on the bed so it's so much so comforting to have them so close and to feel so loved <laughs> and nobody loves you like your dog nobody <laughs> but uh you all have a wonderful day god bless you and i'll talk to y'all on the next one bye now <laughs>